So as somebody who's a teenager, there are obviously life lessons that you learn in these years that you just don't anywhere else. And for some people, they don't learn these lessons until much later on in their lives, if at all. So if you're watching this video, these are the four life lessons that you need to hear right now. Now firstly, and this is by far the biggest one, is to start investing as soon as possible. As somebody who's been investing for close to two years now, it could be one of the most important decisions that you ever make in your entire life. And if you watch or talk to any financial advisor, they'll all tell you the same thing, to start literally right now. That if you're employed and you're making money, to go to the bank and open up a Roth IRA this very second. And not just this, but become familiar with a couple different types of trading. Because in the world we live in, this is a highly valuable skill to have. And it's also something that you're going to need to know at least a little bit about eventually. Now to start learning about this, I recommend doing two things. Firstly, is to just start trading and investing into a couple different low risk things. With time, you'll start to see what you enjoy trading and you'll lean into your strong suits. For example, I started off trading individual stocks. That's probably not the smartest move for most people. But after that, I moved over to crypto. Then I opened up a Roth IRA. And then I did a bit of options trading for a little while. I stopped doing options trading because it's highly risky and I don't really enjoy doing it. Personally, I stick to individual stocks and crypto because it's what I enjoy trading and it's also what I'm good at. And secondly, to start learning more about this, I really recommend that you just find somebody who's done this before. That can be really helpful. Or just load up YouTube and watch a couple different videos on how to get started. It doesn't hurt at all. In fact, only about a month or two ago, I made a video on the best way to get started with investing in stocks. So when you're done with this video, go make sure and check it out. It's going to be in the comment section below. Now the second life lesson is for you to get as physically active as possible. Now I know you've heard this before, but this is a serious thing because I'm noticing two different types of people that are evolving in this next generation. Firstly are the people who are doing the work. They're keeping themselves in shape, they're going to the gym, they're eating healthy, and they're doing the mental work as well. And the second group is the slackers. These are the people who are laying around all day, they're lazy, they're not doing anything, they're scrolling on TikTok for hours and hours, and then complaining that the world is unfair. And this even consists of the people who are vaping and smoking weed. Breathe air! You don't need a vape! and all of this other nonsense that is horrible for you. So when I say that you need to get as physically active as possible, I'm not saying that you need to go and run 10 miles every day. I'm saying take care of your body because this is going to lead to hundreds of different health benefits that you don't even realize are possible. I'm talking about increased focus and motivation. You're going to want to get up in the morning and I know that sounds crazy to you. And not only that, but as you get older, it's going to become more and more important that you're in good health if you want to stay functioning at the level you are right now. And talking about this topic kind of leads us into our next life lesson, which is that you need to focus on you and your mindset as much as possible. Because one of the very few things that you can control in this world is your mindset. You can't control other people, you can't control the weather, you can't even control your own life sometimes. You might get hit by a bus, and there is nothing you can do about that. The only thing you can control is your mindset. You control whether you wake up every single morning happy or depressed. So if this is something you can control, why are you choosing to be sad? Because sure, you can choose to be the victim. You can be sad and depressed and everything else. Or, like I said earlier, you can go to the gym and work it off. But let me tell you, only one of these options is going to get you jacked. So like I said, focus on you and your mindset because having a good, strong mindset is one of the best assets you can have in the entire world. Now the last life lesson that you need to hear is to just go out and try as many different things as possible and find out what you enjoy. That's what I'm doing and it's working great. I'm trying YouTube and I'm working on different skill sets and all of these different things and finding what I'm good at and what I enjoy. And I highly recommend you do the same because by doing this, you're going to find out what you enjoy, what you don't enjoy, and even what you're good at. And if you watch people like Alex Hermosi or Elon Musk talk about what they think is the best way to start making money, they're not going to tell you to go to college. They're going to tell you to go out and get a job and acquire skills that nobody else has. Why? Because while everybody else is off partying and spending $200,000 on college, 
you'll be acquiring skills that are invaluable to millions of people in the world. And as you acquire even more skills, what will happen is now you have what I call a compounding skill set, where the more skills you have, the more you will theoretically get paid over time. And that's why this is a very important lesson for you to hear as soon as possible so that in 10 or 20 years, you don't wake up with $300,000 worth of student loan debt, which is only compounding on interest every year, by the way, and finally realize, oh, I should have opened up the business that I aspired to when I was 17 years old instead of going to college. Anyway though, I digress because that is not the point of this last lesson. The point of this last life lesson is for you to go out and try as many different things as possible before you graduate high school, before you are forced by the world to go out and do something that you don't want to do. And ladies and gentlemen, that is the true purpose of this last life lesson that I have for you. All together though, these are the four life lessons that I have for you guys in this video. But as I stated before, the best way to get started with the first life lesson which is investing is to check out this video right here where i walk you through a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to get started with investing in the stock market in only a few minutes so with that said thank you all for watching and i will see you all in the next one